He doesn't understand me. He doesn't even try. Daddy's never even met a human, yet he thinks the worst of them. I just don't see how a world that makes such wonderful things could be so bad. Mrs. of the Deep, you have a visitor. I'm not so sure about this. Now, now, dear, mustn't get cold fins. Ariel, darling, it's me, your Auntie Ursula. I'm not sure I should be here. Father said you're wicked and hateful. <laughs> he says the same things about humans, too, doesn't he? Now tell your Auntie Ursula all about it. I'm in love with someone. With a human. Oh, that prince fellow. Quite the catch. Well, the answer is simple. You must become human yourself. Can you help me? 
My dear sweet child, it's what I live for. To all unfortunate merfolk like yourself. Poor souls with no one else to turn to. I'll admit that in the past I've been a nasty. They weren't kidding when they called me well a bitch. But you'll find that nowadays I've mended all my ways. Repentance in the light and made a switch. True, yes, but I fortunately know a little magic. It's a talent that I always have possessed. And you're lit, please don't laugh. I use it in behalf of the miserable, lonely, and depressed. Yes, indeed. Those poor unfortunate souls, though sad but true, they come flocking to my cauldron, crying spells. I so love, please, and I help them. Yes, I do. Now it's happened once or twice. Someone couldn't pay the price. I'm afraid I have to run across the coals. It's a bad, the odd complaint, but on the whole, I've been a My best offer, Ravikins. I know a spell that'll turn you into a human for three days. But of course, there is one more thing. My fee. A kind of squid pro quo. <laughs> but I don't have anything. I'm not asking for much. Just your voice. My voice? If I give away my voice, how would I ever- You have your looks, your pretty face, and don't underestimate the power of body language. The men at there don't like a lot of blabber. They think a girl who gossips is a bore. There's some lattice mantra for the ladies not to say a word. After all, dear, what is I don't run It's she who wants her tongue who gets her mad.